Tucker Company sent me this picture hanging and leveling tool, and it has 85 pieces, and it's got uh, with hardware case. So it's got the actual tool, and it's got hardware case with uh, 85 pieces inside of it. We'll take a look at this today. Rattling and rolling here. See what's inside the package here. So we've got instructions here. I'll just open it up. So there's the case itself. Got some instructions. So this comes apart here. All kinds of stuff inside this case here. There's wires, there's clips, there's screws, there's hangers, all kinds of stuff. Here it has some picture hanging instructions. And it has all these little labels. So these labels will go on these little things here. And this is a part of the case, so this doesn't use this part of it. And this is the case that comes with it. So I take it off here in the bottom and in the back of it here. That'll just come off. So you've got this part of it, which you're going to use to level your pictures and your case here with all your different pieces. You come with all kinds of stuff, all kinds of hooks, some wire here, different picture size, picture hangers and different uh, nails for it and these things we're using these today and these are small little screws here's the tool itself it's got some parts in it this is a pin that removes the pin to mark it so you would hang your picture on this and uh, this pushes down so you slide your picture on this other hook on these two hooks, or this bottom hook here. Once you get it in position, then you remove this pin here. This little pin there that comes with it. And then just mark whatever you have, either two or one. It slides right in there. See, it's got a pin right through it. Mark it on your wall. Then you know where to put your hook. That pin comes in here. Now, when you're putting it up through your level, it shows you what the level is. Now, once you get it, let's put it, take it back together. Once you get it leveled, then this this level will come off, and then you can hang it right on top of the picture after. So, there's multiple parts of this, and these two are magnetic. And we'll take a look at the back. There's just uh, kind of like a silicon rubber feet there to slide on your wall. So these are magnetic, and we'll see how they work. My calendar and the Every day, month, and they change. I'm gonna just mark it here, up in the bottom and side there. And uh, every time I change the calendar, there's a little pin in the back here. And you see that pin? Now that's hard to line up. Maybe two or three tries every time to get it. So we're gonna try something different. Sakura has these two metal pieces that we're going to use, try out. And uh, for these little clips here, so they, they're magnetic, so they go in like this. And that, you attach this with screws to the calendar, and then these will punch a hole in your wall, a marking in your wall, and it goes like this. Same with this one. So you attach it your calendar here and then they just put it on the wall hit it and then you've got your marking on the wall where your pins are going to go a little small pilot hole just to get it started here nice to have that magnetic screwdriver this is a Hupar screwdriver Using a number two Phillips screwdriver here. The other two in. So 
Phillips screw. So now it'll mark the wall. These pins, these pins come out. They're magnetic. It'll show us on the wall. We're gonna put our pins. So we'll remove this one. It'd be in our way, we'll move it. And then just use those other clips. Mark it on the wall and then secure it to the wall. That's not magnetic, that's just a good screwdriver that holds it. Here's our pin that's going to mark it with that. It's magnetic. We'll put it on the wall and just bang it and we'll mark where we're going to hang our calendar. What? And then we're going to line it up with the mark, pencil marks there. Level with the floor. And then we're going to put the level on it, that little level here. Level it up a bit here. Yeah, pretty level there. And I'm just going to top it on both sides there. Make our mark. There are, there it is. Both holes. This is a panel wall. Mm -hmm. So I got the two marks here and the wall here, and we'll just put our pins in here. Move the pins because now we're going to hang it, hang our calendar on the wall here. Move our pins. Now we're hanging it up on the wall here. There you go. We'll put our level on it. Pretty level. So we got it all lined up and nice and level here. So there's two hooks. There's actually three, but we're going to use these two hooks and hook it on the back. There's a wire in the back of this clock here. And we'll hook it, and I'm gonna put it on the wall here. Just left it about where we want it here, and then we'll make sure it's nice and level. That's where I want it. Take the clock off, and then we're gonna mark it on the wall. So we got a level here. The level shows it where I want it. Take this little red pin out here, and just mark it through the wall here. And it's marked. Put the pin back in here. So we marked it on the wall here. We'll take this down. Here's our little mark on the wall there. And it's done. So here's our hole. We use that little red marker. We'll put our picture hanger in here. Level off the soccer gauge here. We're going to level our picture, make sure it's level. It on here. And we'll put that small level on top of it. It sits on top of the frame here. And just level up the top. Perfect. That soccer's picture hanging leveling tool here, and this comes off and this marks your pins here, and this is metal magnetic and all kinds of parts with this nice little case kind of a handy thing to have for picture hanging all in one I'd like to thank all my subscribers all my new subscribers thanks so much for subscribing to my channel if you watch this for the first time today please subscribe to my channel don't forget to ring that bell for my next video which will be coming soon thanks for taking the time to watch the video today people have a great day